Hey everybody, we're back with another video. I went ahead and got the uh, top or that, that section cut off of there and that worked out real good. You can see now that there's a nice a nice step right there. So um, this will make putting the top back on really easy and get a good seal. Um, also I stitched the top on here. See, this is what I was talking about, about stitching when you're doing thin gauge metal together. Um, I stitched it like here, and then here, and then here, and then I went back in between, and then I stitched in between, and I kept going in between until I got a bunch of stitches in there. And now, what I'll do is I'll just weld from here to here, and then I won't get a bunch of buckling and warping going on. And then I thought what I'd do is after I get that... Uh, weld it all the way around. I'll grind it down so it doesn't look uh, too awfully bad. I'm not the greatest welder in the world, obviously. Um, but then I'd take that uh, that ring that I took off from the inside that held the uh, diaphragm in place, and then I will place that inside, and that'll that will go back over the top of where that weld is. I'll stitch that in there. That'll just give that uh, that seam a little bit of extra protection. Um, so I've got this, uh, I got the rack in here. I still may add a few pieces across here. Um, I'm not done welding that, that aluminum, or that, I keep calling it aluminum, that angled, um, bracket. I'm not done welding that all together yet. Um, just kind of dry fitting and seeing how things go together. But see, we got a nice, nice tight fit all the way around here. Um, I'm trying to decipher if I want to uh, weld that in place or I would like to keep it removable so and I don't think the temperature is going to be too awfully high right here so I may just try some uh, some RTV silicone some high temp silicone right there um, I also could put some uh, uh, some refactory cement you know and pack all this in on the inside to seal it up so still uh, still in deliberation on that one but anyway, that's as far as I got so far. I'll come back when uh, when we get a little further with the project. Um, all right, thanks for watching.